Lua filters. This video is on assigning metadata, Pandoc metadata, using a table and a function. Here is the um, my uh, function that's going to be assigning the metadata. And within this, I have a table of theme values. And you can see it has a key and then a value. So page line, title style, all these things in this table. And then I give it a value. This is how I define my themes. The curly brackets are things that are tables. Actually, all of these are tables, but I put um, curly brackets around things that uh, for my application could be multiple values. And this is mainly just a reminder for myself. For um, I, um, what I'm working on is something that is going to be uh, going into a Pandoc template for LaTeX. And there are times when I need to pass in a uh, LaTeX code. When I need to do that in this table, this is the way I do that. This is very specific to Pantoc metadata. So you need to say it's an inline, and then you tell it's a raw inline, and then you need to tell it what it is. And there you go, you have your code. I imagine if you need to do other things like HTML, you could use that too. I don't know. OK, so then I have that. And then I have a function assigned values that is going to assign this to the metadata. So let's take a look at what this does. So the function is assign value. It takes a table and it does a for loop over the pairs of this table. So the pairs are things like this key value and value. So it's going to go over all the key value pairs. And this is the key and this is the value. And for each of those, it will go through and in my application, these key values, these values here, they're part of a larger table for the title page theme. So this is the metadata uh, table, um, sort of key, key value that this is part of. And then here's that uh, key. It's coming in here. It's the second level of this table. So it's here. And what it does is ask, is that empty? So did the user pass in their own value? If it did, I don't want to overwrite that. I only want to use the theme values if they didn't pass it in. So it asks, is it empty? Yeah, it is empty. If it is, then I'm going to assign the value in that table to the value in the pair. So just kind of goes through all these and assigns it. That's it.